Hi everyone, this is Ola from Perry Rangers and I'm here today to talk to you about the hidden job market or in other words about a selection of job ads which we or our team, our research team handpicks every week uh, from difficult to find places on LinkedIn, um, making sure that they're real selection processes and to make sure also that they appeal to experienced managers and executives so people with at least 10 years of experience people with international backgrounds the job ads are actually in english and we make sure that they are um, there's a high likelihood that they are aimed at internationals um, they also have interesting features like um, multiple locations that you can work out of like the possibility of remote work um, digital elements where um, you know the real um, interesting opportunities. Um, I wanted to show you a couple of examples so that you actually see what we mean when we talk about job ad gens. So let's have a look. The first of our two job ads for today is based in Paris, the employer's RTB house, which uh, is an advertising and marketing company, a growing one, serving large brands like Adidas or Decathlon. They're looking for head of sales, so someone who will help them grow even more um, and it's a very fresh ad it was actually posted 10 hours ago um, one of the examples one of the things that um, is among the requirements is at least 12, 12 years of experience in direct sales including three in managing sales teams um, native french and fluent english are among the requirements and also a good network so these are just some examples of what RTB House is looking for. If you click apply here, you will be taken to an external platform and both the URL and the little logo at the bottom of the page will tell you that it's a Jobvite platform. If you click on that, on the link, at the bottom of the page, you will be taken to their um, website and you will find out that they provide solutions for recruitment, including ATS systems. It's important for you for one reason. The reason is, if you know this is an ATS um, recruitment, this means the first screening will be done by a bot and your CV should uh, be able to get through the bot's algorithm. I'll tell you a little bit more about this later. The second job ad is based in Bucharest, Romania. The employer is Noble Limited. This is an IT company, one of the best employers actually. They voted a, um, a great employer in IT and C, they're looking for head of legal, and uh, this is a director level job. And this would be someone with at least 10 years of experience in providing international legal services. If you click apply here, you can see that it's actually a LinkedIn easy apply system. So I'm just going to show you the first page here, but what matters is that LinkedIn actually populates this form uh, at each of the steps with information from your profile your LinkedIn profile, so it's a good idea to have um, proper information there. So have make sure that it's up to date and it's accurate. That's it for the examples for today. Job ads like the two examples that I showed you today and more um, around Europe in different countries and different functions um, can be found on the Hidden Job Market for Experienced Managers in Europe group on Mondays um, and also on our blog where the full list is uh, published. Also on our blog, you can find a lot of different free resources, including something I find myself talking about pretty much every week. So hacking the ATS, applicant tracking system. So the uh, computer screening that you're going to find more and more often um, in large scale um, international recruitment processes, especially. And so this is a guide that you can use on your own to optimize your CV for artificial intelligence. You can of course also ask us for help, we'll be happy to help you out. Another thing that we'll be happy to provide is a free CV report for your human CV. So if you want to know if it's up to scratch, if it's something um, that uh, will work for you in your job search, you can absolutely go for it. And we offer free career consultations. So we actually talk about your plans um, in uh, a more general way. So just making sure that your, your um, job search directions and goals are um, make sense. Uh, and I think that's it for today. If you have any questions, if you have anything that you'd like to comment on, then absolutely feel free to leave comments under the 
video or email me with questions um, about anything that I talked about today and we're going to take a holiday break for a couple of weeks we'll be back in the new year and so uh, i also wanted to wish you a very very good end of the year and a very very good entry into a new year hopefully it will be kinder to all of us so take care and see you very soon bye bye